If you're looking to run Quantower or Nitro on your Mac, iPhone, iPad, or even Android, this is the video you've been waiting for. Whether you have a brand new MacBook or a really old one, we're going to show you step by step how to get Quantower and Nitro up and running. And the best part? This setup works across all devices so you can trade on the go or at your desk no matter what system you're using. We'll cover how to use it for fast-track trading accounts and other prop firms like Apex, Topstep, and even self-funded brokerages like AMP. Let's dive in and get you trading smoothly on any device you choose. The first step to get started is to sign up for a plan at ninjamobiletrader.com. Even if you're using a Windows computer, you'll want to do this because these are highly optimized trading servers located in Chicago, designed to give you the fastest order fills with the least amount of slippage for trade copying. For Mac users, this is a much better choice than using Parallels. Since these servers are independent from your computer, they won't cause your Mac to overheat or slow down, and everything running on the server will keep going without interruption, even if you lose internet or power. And if you're on fast track, running it on our servers means you won't have to deal with rhythmic connection problems anymore. Sign up at ninjamobiletrader.com. Once you're logged in, you'll see the My Account page. We're going to need the login details from here later, but for now, move it out of the way and open up the Apple App Store. Search for Remote Desktop in the App Store. Apple has recently updated the app name to Windows Apps and changed its look. Previously, it used to look like this, but now it's been updated under the new name Windows App. Look for the new Windows App. And if you can't find it, try searching for the previous name, Microsoft Remote Desktop Connection. If you can't find either, or if your Mac is older and says it's not compatible, Check the description of this video for a link to older compatible versions. You can also email us at support at ninjamobiletrader.com and we'll be happy to help you get everything set up. Apple is constantly updating the look and feel of this application, so yours might not look exactly the same as in this video, but it should be very similar and you should still be able to follow along without any issues. Look for a plus button to select Add PC. In the PC name field, enter the IP address by copying and pasting it. Next, click on Add User Account. This will save your username and password, so you won't need to enter them every time. Copy and paste both the username and password. Then, click on the Add button and ensure the drop-down is selected to the username you just added. The most common mistake is accidentally copying and pasting the credentials with an extra space at the beginning or end of what you're highlighting. So, make sure there are no extra spaces, and that you've copied and pasted the credentials correctly. If it's not working, you can always come back and re-enter them to try again. For customizing options, click on the Display tab, where you'll find several settings you can adjust. If you have multiple monitors, you can use Remote Desktop across all your screens by selecting that option. By default, it opens in full screen, but adjusting the resolution resize will make running it within a window much easier. Optimize for Retina displays is also a great choice when using full screen. For this demo, I'm going to launch it within a preset window size, and here's how you can do that. One last thing to check out is the Devices and Audio tab. Here you'll find options for enabling your microphone and camera to work through remote desktop, though this is optional. It's just good to know where these settings are if you ever need them. By default, clipboard should be enabled, allowing you to copy and paste between your Mac and the remote desktop. For transferring files, the easiest method is simply copying and pasting the file between the two. Click the Add button and you're ready to connect. Double-click on your newly saved connection. The first time you connect, you'll see a pop-up message. You can click Continue, or if you prefer, click Show Certificate to save it so you won't be prompted each time. Check the Always Trust box, then click Continue. Lastly, enter your Mac password to save these settings. On the server, you'll find Ninja Trader, R Trader Pro and TradingView Desktop already pre-installed. Plus, there's a NinjaTrader license key that allows you to connect to multiple self-funded accounts, Tradeavate prop firms, and Rhythmic accounts simultaneously, so you can copy trades between all your accounts with ease. For Nitro and Quantower, open up the web browser inside the server and search for Quantower Download. I've also included a link in the description for downloading Nitro. Now let's walk through how to download and install Quantower and the steps are exactly the same for Nitro. On the Quantower download page, click the download button. Once the installer is downloaded, open it up. It should be a quick download. Click extract, and when it's done, don't worry if you see a pop-up about installing the runtime dependency. Just click download it now, 
select the Chrome web browser, and the file should download automatically. Run it, click Install, and you're all set. That's it. You should now have Quantower or Nitro installed and ready to use on your Mac. Now let's quickly go over how to connect with a Rhythmic prop firm in Quantower. This setup works with all Rhythmic prop firms, and I'll demonstrate it using Fast Track Trading. The process is very similar for other firms like Apex, Topstep, Bulinox, and more. When you start Quantower for the first time, dismiss the Try Out Quantower pop-up and select Rhythmic in the top right corner. Enter the Rhythmic username and password provided by your prop firm. The most important step is to select the correct server. For Fast Track, look through the list and choose Fast Track Trading Chicago Area. For other companies, select their corresponding name, but always pick the Chicago Area location. Our servers are co located with Rhythmic in Chicago, so this option ensures you get the fastest connections. If you've ever had issues with your Fast Track accounts, do yourself a favor and invest in our servers. You'll experience seamless rhythmic connections without any of the usual problems. If you run into any trouble, feel free to email us at support at ninjamobiletrader.com and we'll be happy to guide you through it with a one on one screen sharing help call. We hope this video tutorial helped you learn how to use Quantower with your Mac. If you have any questions, feel free to let us know in the comments or send us an email. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials and trading tips.